you've been through is unimaginable. But I can't help you unless you open up. Miss Walker. Miss Walker. 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 Fetch! Please, tell me what happened. Okay. My parents called me in when they found that I had powers. I was... dumbstruck. But my brother Brent, he always took care of me. He just grabbed my hand and we ran. Spent a few years living on the streets, staying out of sight, keeping on the move. We did some shitty things to make money. But that job we pulled before leaving Seattle? Worse than the rest of it combined. Come on, sis. It's just one more job. It's all loaded up. Let's just go. No, this one's the payday. Mm-hmm. How much? Enough to rent a decent place. <sighs> yeah? Yeah. Enough for a short-tailed Burmese cat. Huh? Oh, that's low. <laughs> <laughs> it's enough for a fresh start. We could use one. Shit, get out, get out! What? It's the cops. Right, you hide, hide! I'll distract them. No, wait! You do this job, we leave tonight. No one will be able to find us? Yeah, as soon as... No. No! Do not use your powers! I'm not gonna kill anyone, just... carry my weight. Fetch! <sighs> You, come over here. Look at me. Eyes up. Right here. Uh, is this really necessary? On the process. All right, kid. Over here. You seen a kid with a mohawk on this dock? If I search that boat of yours, am I gonna find him? Wait! You wanna see a trick? Brent always pushed me to keep my power secret. If anyone knew a conduit was in town, there'd be a manhunt. And it happened before. But that night, I wasn't worried. I'd use my powers to get the job done, then the two of us would take off. We'd be miles away before the DUP showed up. Stay out of sight. I'm gold. Brent, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. But as soon as you started to glow, the whole city went crazy. This is too dangerous. We need to leave now. The DUP's coming. I thought you wanted a fresh start. And you know I want that cat. Just tell me what the job is so I can do it. Uh, fine, just be fast. It's the penthouse at Third and Stone. Break in, grab the red duffel bag. Okay. What's in the bag? You get it? And we're leaving with a literal boatload of cash. <laughs> I like the sound of that. We'll get out of Dodge, bro. You're always one step ahead of me. Just be fast. The thought of you in a DUP prison, I couldn't live with myself. Yeah. 
Knock, knock. What? No witnesses! Kill her! But about the case! We leave! I just want the red duffel bag! That's it! Charge up. Gonna need it. Okay. Fetch, you okay? Were you in that? What happened? The uh, place was full of Russians dancing around a bomb. Shit. The occurrence. They found him. Found who? My boss. If they knew about the penthouse, then they'll know about our boat. We gotta go now. Fine. Warm up the engine. I'll be right there. I'm sorry about all this. I really wanted to get you that Burmese cat. I know. Next time, bro. Patch, stay away from the boat. The currents are just outside. They got guns. What? I'll be right there. No. You have one of your panic attacks near these guys. They'll freaking take you. I'm keeping it together just fine. I got you. Now hang up and hide, dummy. I'd start to freak out. I'd focus on Brent. It was the only thing that'd calm me down. I clung to a good memory. First night in Seattle, we found this overpass and got out of the rain. Ended up reading comics by flashlight until we fell asleep. Later, this guy snuck in and tried to steal what little we had. And I was about to make him pay for it. That night, we established the rules. Rule number one, no powers, no matter what. We might lose some gear, but Brent didn't want us to lose us. I shouldn't have used my powers. It was my fault he was gone. It was my... I lost it! Those breaks from reality changed me. I'd wake up with new powers. It was like my body decided to fight, but my mind just gave up. You've been very forthcoming, Miss Walker. How about a break? You can show me the skill you acquired from your mental snap. I thought you wanted to get control of your powers. That's what we're here for. I don't know. Last time I used them... We'll I... start with something simple. I'll be watching your progress from up there. Please don't try anything stupid. stupid. 
All I do is stupid. No, Miss Walker. You're a survivor. Everyone has a weakness. You just have to look for it. There you go. It's a start, but the world won't wait for you. Sometimes you need to act fast, follow your instincts. Not bad. Not great. But you just started. Perhaps you'd like more relatable targets. Impressive, aren't they? These hard light holograms look and feel real. Now, please kill them. I don't just mindlessly shoot things, okay? Oh, the conduit up here making those holograms, Eugene, he won't mind. What's the point? The point is survival. Not just for you, but for those who can't defend themselves. Go on, protect him. Nice to see you still have some fight in you. Let's hope your other senses are still as sharp. The clock's ticking. Find and save the hostage. Well done. Now, I've hidden a second hostage somewhere nearby, but this time you'll have to move quickly to save him or he'll die. Horribly. Wasn't the fastest time I've seen on that test. Let's try something else. Push yourself. How high can you jump? You've proven basic mastery. But are you tenacious, Miss Walker? When presented with a challenge, do you fight your way through? Or hide in a corner. On guard, Miss Walker. Better hurry. This new hostage looks weak. We've got another victim coming. They just keep coming, don't they? Miss Walker, there's another hostage. You wouldn't like to see him die. In the hang
Here comes another helpless soldier. to play the savior again. Alive, Miss Walker, or you won't be for long. Much improved. That was an acceptable performance on the hostage exercise. We keep score, you know. Other conduit achievements are posted to irritate and inspire you. I'm always open to more training. Perhaps you'd like to surpass them. That'll do for now. Take a seat. I'd like you to resume your explanation of what happened in Seattle. After a night of tearing up the city looking for my brother, I ended up back at what was left of our boat. That's where I met him. He was looking for Brent too. Excuse me, sweetheart. I'm sorry, have you seen a fella rocking a mohawk around here somewhere? Wait, do you know... Do you know Brent? Are you with those Russians? What, the occurrence? Oh, hell no. Well, are, are you saying they're the ones who did this? Damn it, they keep kidnapping my employees. Kidnap? Wait! Do you know where they have him? Can you take me? Oh, <laughs> slow down there, sugar. Now, I'm sure you do not want to get that pretty face caught up in all this trouble. You know, I don't know what you had worked out with Brent, but, uh... He's my brother. Help me. Brother? Uh, are you Fetch? I'm Shane. Shane? You know, Brent never told me that his sister was such a pretty little thing. Please! Just tell me where to look. Uh, east side, mainly. Thank you. And if you think of anything else, then call me on Brent's phone, all right? Yeah, yeah, sure. Whatever you say, sweetheart. Just make sure you take care of that, all right? I've got to get this city ready for the real me. Need some neon. Lots of neon. Okay, I'm already headed for some neon gas. Whoa, whoa, firecracker. Now, I love huffing gas as much as the next guy, but is that really... It's a trick I picked up back in Jersey. 
The gas helps me run insanely fast. All right. I'm gonna have to take your word on that conduit. What other secrets you got going on under that hood? That big sign. Gonna need it to find Brent. Yeah, that's big enough. Come on, cough it up! All right, you lazy neon gas. Go make yourself useful. <laughs> That's a boost. I need all the firepower I can get. They taste good. A big one. And it moves. Fetch, sweetheart. Did you have something to do with that light show by the needle? I told you I needed some neon gas. Just focus. Uh, I gotta go. Something really distracting just came into my field of view. You wanna stand? Bye. I'm zipping through those clouds, I'll haul ass. You luscious neon fatty. I'm meeting you whole. <laughs> I missed this. Oh yes. <sighs> they taste better when they run. are coming to me. Where's Brent? Oh, none of you speak English? <sighs> okay, that's Here it comes. Darling, my feelers just pawed something juicy. Dude. Now, the occurrence are about to receive a stockpile of guns. You help me steal them, and I'll have 50 armed men out kicking indoors looking for Brent within the hour. Great, thank you. And enough with the feelers. I get it, you're a creep, okay? Let's move past it. Uh, now, now, I will have you know that some women find me irresistible. Sure, if you're paying them. It Look, just meet me in the alley behind that sandwich shop when you're ready to steal the guns, all right? Au revoir.
one's for you, Brent. <laughs> Our truck's loaded up! Let's go! I think I set off an alarm breaking in to get the guns. If the currents catch up with us, you better cover my ass. Let's go, it'll be fine. Uh, you see, honey, if they find out it was me that stole this stuff, there'll be a retribution which I would very much like to avoid. Come on, you have a conduit on your side. They're hosed! We'll get these guns to your men, and they'll use them to find Brett's. We're good. They're stealing our guns! Fetch! Stay close, I got him. Shoot the conduit! Shoot the conduit! should hide just for a bit. Give me a chance to recharge. Right. Well, I know just the spot. I think we're clear. Let's roll. Oh, how come I never saw? 
saw you on the news. Heavy hitter conduit like you must be public enemy number one. I got Brent. He keeps me grounded and low profile. Well, into the line. We'll unload here. It's fine by me. Come on. We made a hell of a team out there on the streets. Imagine what we'd be like in the sack. Get your boys armed and out looking for Brent, or I'll lay a hole in your sack. Now, what if I told you I already have some guys asking around for your brother? I'll send you their position. They might have heard something by now. You go from creep to okay in just a sentence. How do you do that? Well, born and raised in Texas. My guys out searching for Brent got made by the occurrence. Now, I'm sorry, honey, but I need to call my boys back. It's just too dangerous. No, no, I'll protect him. Tell your men I'll protect anyone out looking for Brent. Ugh! This'll work. I'll shoot him once I open up. Gotta be fast. Shane. Your boy's still breathing. 
Well, I'm glad to hear you're good at this. There's another one of my guys just got spotted. I'll take care of it. Just send me his location. Spotted. Let's use that. Have them all head for Olaf's restaurant by the harbor. I'll head out on top and drop the occurrence when they show. Yeah. yeah that's not bad. All right, well, I, I could be out back of Olaf's with a truck. And once you open fire, I'll pick up my boys. And then we're gone. their attention. Get you guys out. Yes, ma'am. Okay. My boys are out moving down the side alley. Not that anyone's noticed. The occurrence are all shooting at you. Fine by me. They almost shattered bones? Be my guest. You guys okay? Any of them find Brent? Well, I think you motivated them. <laughs> Watching you go to town? Oh, it is incredible, girl. You are the Grim Reaper. I'm not a monster. I'm just... I gotta help my brother. Sometimes I lose it without him. And you, madam, are in luck. One of the men you just saved? He heard an current lieutenant made a collection in Georgetown. Now, if we find this guy on surveillance footage, we may be able to track them back to where they're holding Brent. You know, every now and then, you're okay. Oh, does that mean you're finally gonna let this cowboy ride the bull? Bulls are all male, dude. Yeah, well, whatever. Over the phone? We'll use city cameras. You get me their IDs. 
then I'll know where to look for footage. I'm sending you the location where our guy was last seen. Sorry, camera IDs? Who are you again? Jenny. I work for the city, and uh, sometimes shame. The camera ID is like a QR code. You can scan for it using your phone. Send me that, and I can search for the footage for this guy. We've got some killer facial recognition software. It's kind of creepy. All right, I'm here. Find a camera near me. Okay, got it. Scan me the ID so I can look for footage. That's our guy. Follow him. We'll use individual cameras to find out which way he went. I'm sorry I can't do a full system scan, but it had set off alarms here at work. What are we looking for here? I'm told the occurrence have some kind of safe house where they keep prisoners. If we follow him, he'll lead us to it. And Shane? What's your deal with him? Well, you're looking for your brother. I needed something else. Now when Shane calls, I help him out. I just have to be really careful here at work. What'd you need? Just don't get in too deep with this kind of stuff. So who is this guy anyway? He's a human trafficker for the occurrence. Human trafficking? Like, as in slaves? Yeah. And I think he's following that girl. <sighs> Nothing. Crap, wrong way. She's picking up the pace. You think she spotted him? Find out what happens to her. Time to backtrack. Looks like there's some sort of crime scene here. He just... He just killed that guy. And these are the men who have my brother. That didn't have anything useful.
Hold on. Looks like he dropped something. Hello. Jenny, do you think you could find out where that guy goes all day if you had his phone? Sure. It'd take a little while. I just need a copy of his SIM card. I'll send it over. We're gonna get my brother back and shut these assholes down at the same time. Bitch! My guys out beating the bushes got ambushed by currents. It's bad. So, you want me to rush in and really brutalize the tracksuits, huh? Well, yeah. It'd be my distinct pleasure. Just point me in the right direction. Oh, and Jenny kicks ass. Give her a call. We gotta leave. Damn. 